Are you ready for another Nostalgia Station episode? Let's do this. Hello everyone! Welcome back to Nostalgia Station. This is the second episode. Um, I have had a little bit of requests from 1918 Me to do a second episode, and I really wanted to. So, um, I've got a series here that I really love, and that is Animal Crossing. So here's, I've got three games. I do not have Wild World on the DS, but I have New Leaf, uh, City Folk, and the original. Um, I don't have the Japanese N64 Animal Crossing, uh, because I have a North American N64. I don't have a Japanese one, unfortunately. But yeah, and I also do not have the physical copy of Animal Crossing New Leaf. I have the, um, digital copy, because I got the limited edition, because I love the series so much. Um, the only console I ever bought the day it came out, the only console I ever, the only console I ever actually really can remember going to a store to buy, um, I think, it, it was pretty magical, so, let, let's get into that. Okay, so I'm going to be talking about each one of these games individually, and first I have Animal Crossing, and, oh man, just, just look on the back here, I love the box out, the box art, where they're all in the house, just kind of having a good time, and then you can see the characters in the back, um, now, I actually have nostalgia for all these games, uh, believe it or not, I know New Leaf came out last year, it's my least nostalgic, but I have nostalgia from it a little bit, <laughs> um, but this game probably is going to take the cake in the Nostalgia Station Championship of nostalgia, nostalgia -ness, nostalgia, that was a lot of nostalgia, um, yeah, so, it came with a memory card, uh, I don't know if you, if anyone remembers that, because the game took up a lot of space, you had to save all your this and that. I think I remember taking up a lot of memory. I don't know for sure, but, uh, yeah. It was very, very exciting times. Uh, so you got this little Animal Crossing memory card. I don't have it in my case. I just got the manual and this day. The manual's very beat up. But I thought that was kind of cool at the time. And, uh, I have, like, three memory cards in the GameCube. One of them broke. So, uh... When I got this Christmas of 2005, and it was, uh, along with the GameCube, that's when we got the GameCube, uh, I know, the came out in 2001, but, you know, t four years later, who cares, it was awesome, and the thing I remember specifically was I wasn't the first one to play this game, and this is the game that was specifically bought for me, we got, my brothers and I all got different games, and for some reason at the time, I was just really upset by it. I was little back then. But, uh, like, that kind of, I got a little frustrated from that. I, I got over it. Uh, but, yeah, I, I it was, <laughs> so yeah, I don't know. But then I eventually did play it, and it was awesome. I remember we had our GameCube hooked up over there behind the camera, and now it is in my downstairs, and it has been for years, but it used to be up here. And I just remember, like, playing games like that and Super Mario Sunshine, which is another game I got at that time. So really when I think about this game, a lot of times I'll think back to that Christmas, and that's really where a lot of the nostalgia comes in. Um, also just from playing the game, and the, the, you know, the opening scene where you're in the train with Rover, uh, good times. And I, I remember I called my town Galaxy, that was my, that was my own town, and, um, but I had a town with my brothers first, but when I made my own separate town, that's what I called it. And then I remember having my character from that town go to my other town, and, and it was just, it was just legendary. Um, the starter from the series, it, uh, at least in North America, it, it rocked, and I highly recommend it uh, to anyone who, I mean, maybe not an Animal Crossing fan, but you should definitely give this game a shot because it's, it rocks. So, yeah, let's move on to the next game. Okay, so the next is Animal Crossing City Folk, and I don't have too much to say about this game, but there are a few things. Um, so I got this game for my brother's birthday, actually. I remember going to the store with my brother, and, um, not the brother whose birthday, who was his birthday, but a different one, and, uh, and picking up this game, and I also like the box art. I think Animal Crossing really does a good job of the box art. It looks like, it looks like a party town over there, I mean, seriously. Um, but I just remember being so excited being able to go to the city. That was a big deal. 
Like that that was exciting stuff. I don't know if you if you knew it, but I was I was pretty hyped for that. And um yeah, so also the other thing that was pretty big when it was coming out was the Wii Chat. And are uh, the Wii what's it called? The Wii Talk or the Wii Phone? It was something like that. But you had your like friend code number and you could call them and you could talk using voice chat, and I actually never had one of those, I should get one sometime, but oh yeah, I guess you can't do Wi-Fi on the Wii anymore, but I remember like kind of wanting one, whenever I um, talk to people um, online on Wii, which is only when I played Monster Hunter really, I used a keyboard, you plug your keyboard in, and stand close to the, t sit close to the TV, uh, good times, but that was exciting at the time, and even though I never used it, it was kind of a big deal being able to go to other people's games online, and then, you know, um, and then, like, talk to them and hang out. And, you know, we had Wild World back then, and I believe it came out before this, and you could do that, but I never had Wild World. I wasn't, I never had a handheld until 2010 when I got my DS. So that was, that was really cool, and... I remember there was this, this thing that could happen around the evening time when uh, this one character, I don't remember what they were called, they were like, I think it was Phineas? And they would go to the city and you'd get like a balloon from them, or a bubble wand or something, and I kept trying to do that every day and I kept forgetting, but eventually I got it and it was awesome. I don't know if they always come at that certain time every day, or it was only, uh, I don't know, I don't know, it was only sometimes I think. But yeah, there were a lot of features that I was really excited about for this game, and it, it didn't disappoint. It was still the same kind of Animal Crossing we loved from the first two games. Um, we never had Wild World, like I said. But now we have all these new features, and it was awesome. It was a really, really fun experience. Finally, the last game, Animal Crossing New Leaf. Um, so, the main thing that I just the main kind of experience I've had with this game that was really awesome was getting it the day it came out and that was that's not something I usually get to do with games or consoles or anything like that I mean buying a console the day it come out the day it came out no I mean pre, we got a pre-order of the Wii but we didn't get it until Christmas uh, this was amazing like I, I couldn't I, I, I couldn't believe that I was that was actually you know happening. <laughs> to be honest, I was I was in shock the, the time leading up to getting it and the time I actually got it. But before we go to the day I got it, we have to go back a little bit. So when I actually found out I was gonna be able to get it, I started watching like tons and tons of YouTube videos on it. And that's actually when I found out about this channel Lynn and Co. And I'll put a link in the description. But anyways, um the also, my like Animal Crossing unboxes, and I think that, that was so hyped. I can't even, I can't even explain the amount of hype that I was feeling. It was awesome. The excitement was so real. And then the day came, and I was so excited. I could barely get to sleep the night before, and I got it. And cause not only was I getting the game at the time, but I was getting this new 3DS XL. It was limited edition. Everything about it was so exciting. And then I got it, and I I actually uh, did an unboxing on my old channel. I, I can put a link if you want to see that. Uh, it's not the best unboxing in the world, but if you want, I, I'll, I'll link it. Um, and it's just I, like look look at the box art, and this is actually a box, not not a case. So Animal Crossing never disappoints with that, and the 3DS looked beautiful. The game was great. Um, it's not my favorite Animal Crossing. Uh, probably, I mean, it, actually it might be, it, it could be, it's, I might, it's hard to say, it, they're pretty close, they, I, I like them all for different reasons, this kind of had its new features, but it's just, it doesn't have the same nostalgia factor as the first game, which is one of the reasons I love it so much, but then again, I love being able to go play with people on my friends list on uh, 3DS, and that was really cool, so you know, we had this, and I never really got to experience online, but with this game, I did, and that was pretty cool. Being able to go in with other people, and you could you could use like the, just the little text chat. Um, there was no voice chat, I don't think, but I don't think the 3DS really has voice chat. But just the text chat was really cool, and it was very awesome. The fact that you were the mayor really excited me, and you can also actually I didn't find this out until like this year that you can create another character that goes to your town who's not the mayor. I didn't know that. 
I would highly recommend you do that. It's fun to have a mayor character and another character in that town. It was awesome. New characters for the game, new places you can go, you can go to Main Street with all the new shops, you can do all these projects and change the times that your shops are open. It was pretty exciting stuff. But anyways, thank you for listening to me rambling on about Animal Crossing for however many minutes it is. Um, thank you very much for watching, and I'll see you in my next video.